Hi friends, good morning everyone. If you came to our channel for the first time, click on subscribe button and keep sharing our videos to reach maximum people and to help by sharing knowledge. In this video, I'm going to teach you about converting the IDOC status into 68. So generally when the IDOX, there are many failure IDOX are available and which are not at reprocessed and which are not required to reprocess again. So system, the third party system already sent an additional IDOC for that. It is already completed and these IDOCs no need to be reprocessed. We just need to keep it inactive. So in that circumstances, how to change the IDOC status? There is a standard program to convert that IDOC status to 68. Okay. What is 68 also we will see now. So when you go to W05, we will take any failure IDOCs. Let me take uh, current status as 51. Okay. We got certain kind of list of IDOCs. Let me copy this, minimize, go to SC38. So the program name is RC1 underscore IDOC underscore set underscore status. So RC1 IDOC st set status. Give this program and execute it. And you can pass multiple IDOCs or single IDOC. Okay. Based on the requirement, you can pass a certain range or um, you can pass single value based on your requirement. You can keep it. So status 51 and uh, new status you wanted to have 68. And the test icon you need to remove. Execute it. If you keep the test, then system will not work. Only it will replicate it only. It will just show you the data, but nothing happens. We remove the test, so IDOC were converted. Let's see the current status now. Go to W05, input the IDOC number, and uh, give the date, execute it. See, the status is changed to 68. Earlier it was 51, it changed it to 68. What is the 68? See, error, no further processing. So we are just making that no more further processing is possible when the IDOC is in 68. Okay. Even you can test if you want to have, go to BD 87, the reprocessing one. And input the date. See error, no further processing can go there. See the operation cannot be carried out with this note type. So you cannot uh, reprocess that respective IDOCs. So you can see system will not allow you to reprocess at all. For example, if you pass any other IDOC, see at least system is trying to reprocess and if there is still error, it will throw error. So 68 cannot be reprocessed also. So that's why not to do the again reprocessing or duplicate things and all. Uh, if you want to convert that respect to IDOX, the failure IDOX of 51, the inbound IDOX failure ones, you want to convert into 68 so that it will not allow you to make any kind of reprocessing by the user. I hope this video has helped you to understand and I'm showing the program again for your reference. RC1 IDOX set status in between there are underscore. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.